Louis Gossett Jr., the first black man to win a supporting actor Oscar and an Emmy winner for his role in the seminal TV miniseries Roots, has died. He was 87. Gossett's first cousin Neil L. Gossett told the Associated Press that the actor died in Santa Monica, California. A statement from the family said Gossett died Friday morning. No cause of death was revealed. Gossett's cousin remembered a man who walked with Nelson Mandela and who also was a great joke teller, a relative who faced and fought racism with dignity and humor. Never mind the awards, never mind the glitz and glamour, the Rolls Royces, and the big houses in Malibu. It's about the humanity of the people that he stood for, his cousin said. Louis Gossett always thought of his early career as a reverse Cinderella story, with success finding him from an early age and propelling him forward, toward his Academy Award for an officer and a gentleman. Gossett broke through on the small screen as Fiddler in the groundbreaking 1977 miniseries Roots, which depicted the atrocities of slavery on TV. The sprawling cast included Ben Vereen, LeVar Burton, and John Amos. Gossett became the third black Oscar nominee in the Supporting Actor category in 1983. He won for his performance as the intimidating Marine drill instructor in An Officer and a Gentleman opposite Richard Gere and Deborah Winger. He also won a Golden Globe for the same role. More than anything, it was a huge affirmation of my position as a black actor, he wrote in his 2010 memoir, An Actor and a Gentleman. He had earned his first acting credit in his Brooklyn High School's production of You Can't Take It With You while he was sidelined from the basketball team with an injury.